Yo, what is good YouTube? It's your boy ScootZ and today we are back with another Pokemon Skull and Violet VGC video here on the casual ladder using a Regulation D team. Now, as you can see, the team in front of you, this is a team I like to call the fun button. This team is basically built around clicking Dragon to Dragon Energy on Richie Draco and Eruption on Typhlosion. Obviously, you know, we've got the Dragon more Terra Dragon and we just got the Terra Fire coming out on our Typhlosion here. Obviously, this is Sasui and Typhlosion too. Um, I don't think I mentioned that, but yes, the, these two mods here, they're super fun and this, this it's all about clicking the fun button right so on this team we also have tornadoes tornadoes is basically just the the best talent setter we have right it's fantastic it has torn it has tailwind it has sunny day it's really good at just enabling these two in particular obviously making you know the tailwind so they outspeed everything uh sunny day so typhlosions eruptions with that choice scarf don't even necessarily need the tailwind but yeah just absolute nukes um we also have indeedy as well which is an absolutely crucial member of this team indeedy is super super important because this team can be pretty susceptible to uh priority moves basically e-speed can really mess up reggie draco uh same with sucker punch and obviously typhlosion does not want to get sucker punched um so yeah having the ability just to go for like something like a, say a terra fairy follow me uh able to eat the wicked blows the sucker punches obviously chip him down with the rocky helmet is fantastic um and then we just have the flutterfish everyone knows flutterfish is just it's really really damn good let's be honest um Chi obviously too has great synergy with reggie drago and typhlosion giving them that bit of extra pop on their uh on their super nukes and then flutterbane is just flutterbane it's basically a super nuke in itself with choice specs terra fairy dazzling gleam yeah this mon it's it, look it's still just as good as ever let's be honest flutterbane i think uh it definitely you know didn't get much play at the start of reg d's uh ladder just because obviously new toy syndrome but now that everyone's had like a week or so to play around with the mons i think flutterbane is clearly taking over as one of the you know the premier pokemon in the format once again but anyway guys if you're good obviously like comment subscribe all that good stuff oh also um if like half the people like watching this video right now subscribe they're like we'll hit like 2k subs because right now i think like 18 percent of my viewers are subscribed yeah so um thank you uh anyway let, let, let's get into some battles okay that's a definitely a very interesting looking team um ah uh, the god of war does scare out our reggie drago but the good news is i think scarf typhlosion should outspeed his whole team um we're gonna bring drago because this is the drago live uh, and I think our Fluttermane also looks kind of sick in the back here, right? Oh, does he look sick? Hmm. But you also kind of look sick. We'll go Fluttermane, we'll go Fluttermane. I think Fluttermane gives us that little bit of extra damage we need. Um, I guess we just gotta pray Guardi is not Trick Room. Because yeah, that is probably the only thing that really, um... Could really beat us, I think. Distant pass. Okay, Cleaver plus Nizla. Both shiny. Very Pog Champ, boys. Very Pog Champ. Okay, so Sneasla's Unburdened looks like it didn't proc at all there. So that means we should definitely outspeed this and we can just go for the Sunny Day Eruption here. Please don't be a Focus Sash Sneasla. Oh, okay. That's Pog. That's Pog. Is he going to Terra? Okay, he goes to the mouse in the house. Come on, Typhlosion. Do some big, big damage, baby. Let's do some massive damage here, yeah? We've clicked the fun button. The fun button's been clicked. Now nuke Typhlosion. Oh my god, the fun button. Jeez, uh, that's, a, that's a lot of damage. Okay, okay. Who comes next for Typhlosion? Let's just pray that Sneasler doesn't have Fake Out, by the way. Oh, Hasuian Arcanine. That's not good. Okay, um... So boys, this is what we call the old, uh, we sack our Typhlosion now, and then we click the other fun button. And we just go Tailwind here too. Because after this, we can go for the Dragon Energy fun button. Yeah, I had a feeling he had that. That's fine, that's fine. Just head smash my, uh, my Typhlosion, please. Head smash my Typhlosion, please. Thank you. We love that. It's a lot of damage. Hisuian Arcanino, too. A fantastic mod. Definitely a mod I want to build around soon. 
Love to get a live in with it. I think uh, with Choice Bandit can do a lot of damage. All right, so um, this is where we were talking about having our homie in the back, but it should be fine. Reggie Drago should be able to come in here, show off some Dragon's energy and uh, do his thing. Go Dragon energy here, and we pray our Bleak Wind hits both because we really need to break a potential Sash on the other uh, right slot here. Although, actually, breaking... How does break... Oh, dude, please hit the... Please hit the sneeze lot. Dude, are you kidding me? Watch this be sashed. Watch this live on sash now. Yeah, dude, man. <laughs> that was almost the double fun button game. The perfect start. And he just said, you know what? I'm going to hold on with the focus sash. Now, what did you put me to sleep to? Ah, okay. Lovely, lovely. The only issue here now is I bet Unburden kicks in too, doesn't it? Battle scan. So GG to my opponent. That, um, I definitely think they thought with the, the mouse hold, they would have li lived the eruption, which I don't, I think if I sun, if I didn't sun, they might've actually lived it. But yeah, I mean, you know, terror, uh, terrifier eruption in the sun is a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Okay. Um, so not really a reg D team, but they do have Mariadon. Um, interesting. So they have, you know, they have two steel types, which kind of sucks for the other uh, Reggie Drago here. And they also have a fire type, which kind of sucks for Typhlosion here and a dragon, obviously. So they do have a couple answers to the fun buttons, boys. Um, I don't see a trick room setter though, which is great for us. So the question is, which fun button do I want to lead with? They have the fake out. So I'm going to say Typhlosion here. We'll go Reggie Drago in the back. Uh, and then I think... I think she used the play. She just looks really sick. Uh, I think all I need to do here is get up Tailwind and then just start clicking buttons. And I should be in a pretty good spot. Um, I think the second fire type in the back as well is really important here. Because, like, obviously, if we if we do lose um, a homeboy early, uh, especially if they lead, like, Skelzergy, um, then we could be in trouble. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay, Lucario plus Golden Joe. Do you boys know what this means? Yeah, I'm I'm a bit wild. I'm a bit wild. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk throwing it turn one. He he could bullet punch me. I don't think he ever vacuum waves me here. Um, pray to God this isn't like a Terra Water Golden Go. Like, if Golden goes through water here, then we're in trouble. Um, but look, this should be a lot of damage, actually. Oh! Dude, don't, don't be Sash Lucario. I bet it's Sash Lucario, isn't it? Oh! Damage! The fun button? Oh my god. I mean, look, I, I got a sick lead there. Two steals into my eruption. Jesus Christ. That is the fun button, boys. Oh my god. Now, the question is, is Maridon in the back? And it's a Terra Fairy, because I need it to not be Terra Fairy. <laughs> Dude, if he goes on right now and sweeps me, he's just going to reverse sweep me with it, isn't he? Skeledurge, that's annoying. He eats eruptions. And Rhydon, you also eat eruptions. So, how do I want to do this? Um, two pretty damn annoying mons here, I'm not going to lie. Um... I guess we just go Bleak Wind and Eruption. Bleak Wind's good if he Terra's out of the Electric type. Um, and obviously Eruption's good if he Terra's out of the Dragon type. If he goes Terra Fairy here... Oh, okay, he doesn't Terra. I mean, Eruption st should still do decent ship to both these mons, even though they resist. We're in the side. Oh my god, dude. Oh, I missed, of course. I, I, dude, I actually can't hit a bleak one on two mons. Okay, we carried the. That, that's good. But how did, like, I know Skeledurge's special defense is bad. So like, maybe he's just like a super offensive Skeledurge there. But Electro Drift. Oh my god, this is the Typhlosion sweet boys. Dude, that. <laughs> I am. Uh, look, I'm kind of looking forward to the the restrictions coming in, but like, I'm also not. The Maridon looks busted. Uh, let's just, let's complete the sweep. Typhlosion is just, he's, he's gonna do it all himself here. Actually, I wonder if Chi Yu swapping in there actually was good. I wonder if, if I actually went Chi Yu there, that was worth it. 
<laughs> All right, he's, he's stalling out the tailwind, boys. Look out. God damn. All right, all right, all right. Let's go. Come on. Come on, buddy. Our option goes Boro here. Is he going to cancel the battle on me? No, okay. He's going to let Typhlosion take the KO. Very nice. Typhlosion goes Burr. The button of fun in the sun. Dude, Typhlosion is actually having fun in the sun today. My goodness, it's Nukem. Duke Nukem. Okay, so we're up against Sun Room. All right, that's actually pretty damn annoying. Um... Oh, okay. We need to call this correctly, right? So, if he goes Hat and Didi, sorry, if he goes Hat, if he goes Hat, we need Typhlosion. If he goes anything but Hat, we need Reggie Drago. Regardless, I think our our um Indeedy's coming on lead here. Oh, you know what? I feel like Typhlosion has been the star of the show today. Dude, Flashfire actually also makes this kind of hard, right? I mean, it's... It's Shadow Ball actually does do a lot of work this game anyway. Uh, and then we'll go Chiyu. Chiyu's ability to live one attack this game could be massive for us. Like, if if it's something like, you know, up against the Ursa Luna and he just, like, headlongs me or something, and then I can just, like, get off a heat wave in the sun, could be a lot of damage. But I'm not gonna lie, this one looks really scary. Sun Room is not a fun archetype to deal with. Orko plus? Okay, it's Umbridge and Diddy. That's sick. Okay, that's sick. We like this. We like this, yeah? Part of me also is almost is just like, let's just... Like, let's trick room in case he uh, goes for the wide guard here. But I can just like protect next turn and do the same thing, right? Dragon energy, helping hand... Dude, if I pick up both of them here, just go follow me, Trick Room. Follow me, Trick Room, please. Don't click Wide Guard. Wide Guard's not good here. Wide Guard's not good here. I promise you, dude. I promise you. Wide Guard is never the play. Come on. Did you you never want to click Wide Guard here? I promise you. I promise you. Okay, I Terra first. That's good. Just wide. Don't wide guard. Just follow me, Trick Room. Yeah, follow me, Trick Room. That's the. That's your best play. I promise you, that's your best play. Dude, Reggie Draco actually looks so sick. I actually really like how the hat's like on his arm too. It's kind of cool. Helping hand. Oh, dude, don't wide guard. Don't wide guard. Don't wide guard. Don't wide guard. Oh, he protected. That's fine. That's fine. Give me one. Give me one. He's plus one special defense. I've got the helping hand boost. Is it gonna be enough? Oh, and there goes down the Indeedy. Okay. That's a nuke, boys. That's a nuke. That that one KO makes this game so much easier for us. Okay, and it's hat. Hat coming in is actually fine, because what we can do now is we just fire a Draco at the left slot. Um, and that way he can't kill me and get up Trick Room, right? If we just go Draco here and... I don't think Follow Me is ever the play. We always just go Helping Hand here, because he should go Wide Guard here if we're lucky. Show us Wide Guard plus Trick Room, please. Wide Guard plus Trick Room. No, Okay. Okay, so he either attacks or gets up Trick Room. Regardless, I don't think it matters for us which one he did. Okay, and he goes to the Gleam. That's huge. And good, he gets the KO. That's fine. At this point, I don't mind that. I'm A-OK -okay for you to take that off me. Now, his last mods were what? Ursa, Luna, Torkoal, and... Um, what's the other one? Uh, I can't think of it. Hisui and Lilligant, which means we should be good to just start firing off eruptions. Start clicking the fun buttons, boys. And it's Ursa Luna. Okay, that's sick. That's sick for us. It, this kind of like shores up our end game almost here. We just go Eruption and we just go uh, Helping Hand. He's going to protect and Trick Room here. It's his only play. 
Ooh, nah, I was gonna say I could have Shadow Ball, but Shadow Ball is never the play because like Shadow Ball goes to like 160, where Eruption's already 150. So uh, just in case, obviously it doesn't help us out with the um the Ursa Luna either. If he gets up the Trick Room here, helping hand, but 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 but. He wait, did he not protect? He didn't protect. He's a madman. And we just take the hat. I'm guessing he's going to get a KO here on the uh, the Typhlosion, but that's A-OK. -okay. Because, yeah. Oh! Boys, we live in... <laughs> we live in the crunch! I, um... Typhlosion, fire off. One of the weakest eruptions we've ever seen, buddy. We are Scarf, boys. I can't change this. I'm sorry. I'm sure someone's tilted at this. Trust me, I'm not happy either. Watch it do three damage. Ooh. That's not a lot of damage. But indeed, man. Oh, honestly, I would have loved to have seen the uh, the double KO turn one. I think that would have been pretty damn funny. Uh, actually, that would actually probably would have been worse for me, right? If he was able to get Hat and Ursa Lunar in on the same turn. Because that would have been just such a free Protect plus Trick Room. Uh, but yeah, look, GG to my opponent. Um, yeah, that was really good. Really, they play pretty well, um, but yeah, we uh, we, we click the button of fun. Okay, so the first team we have here does kind of look like a Trick Room team. That's pretty damn scary, I'm not going to lie. So, how do we want to play this? I think turn one, it's really, really important we get damage off. Turn two, it's really important we potentially look to reverse a Trick Room. So, the only mon here that really does scare me is probably Mimikyu, um, but I think we can just go these two on lead, right? Like, Eruption's not great into Quagsire or the Arcanine, whereas Dragon uh, Dragon Energy is like good into everything but Mimikyu, um, and Mimikyu will chip itself down as well if necessary. Uh, is this the play? Yeah, indeed he can also reverse the Trick Room. Um... I do like this. I feel like Typhlosion and Torn need to come just for answers to uh, the the Ursa Luna, honestly. Uh, but we, look, we just pray we don't need to worry about answers to Ursa Luna, you know? Fingers crossed they don't leave Mimi and we can go Terra Dragon, Dragon Energy with Helping Hand and just clean up. That, that, that's all a boy wants, man. Let's just clean up, yeah? Come on, just anything but Mimikyu. Anything but Mimikyu. Lead your Cresselia Ursa Luna, please. Please. Okay, and that is the lead we definitely did not want to see here. All right, so... The Intimidate comes out. That's A-OK. -okay. Um, obviously, Akinine here is pretty annoying. Um, I do think we can just fire off a uh, Dragon Energy here, though, as we go for the Follow Me... Because I'm assuming this is going to be something like Blitz plus Will-O-Wisp, right? Which means... So, no, Blitz plus um, Trick Room. That's fine. That's not hitting Mimi. That's okay. Oh, my God. That didn't KO. Probably should have Terra Dragon helping hand it. Okay, and it goes Willow. That's fine. That's fine. All right. So, this is where the game plan comes in. So, this clearly just clicked the, uh, clicked the old Trick Room here. Yeah. Now, we do your boy's favorite play, boys. This is the old protect hit trick room button. Damn, I kind of really wish I just led uh, Typhlosion now. But that's fine. We, we played a little slower than, we, uh, than we'd like to here. This is A-OK. -okay. We just play it slow. Richie Draco is going to do his thing. Oh, please be something weak to this. Please be the Ursa Luna, dude. If this is Ursa Luna, this is so sick. Oh, Cresselia. That's also actually okay, I think. Curse? That's a ghost-type curse. What's that going into? My... What did he just curse? That doesn't go through Protect, right? Yeah, I've got no idea how Curse works. Well... <sighs> I think we're in a position where this Mimikyu is always going to be really damn annoying. So I do think we probably need to look to get rid of it very soon. Um, that way my Typhlosion can just play this game. So 
I think we go the Draco here, and then we just go Dazzling Gleam to, uh, to break it. This should do a lot of damage. That did a lot of damage. Dude, I'm like really regretting not terroring this thing now. <laughs> oh no, he's wooed me. <laughs> That's it, okay. Does Cresselia go for... Dude, if Crest gets up a Trick Room here, I'm going to be so mad at myself. I think Crest does have roughly the same speed as my homie here, so... Luna Blessing. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's actually not fine at all. Um, I mean, I think we're, we're not good to just fire off a Dragon Energy here. We Dracoed. Um, okay, this is a bit more difficult than I'd like. He's also chipping away at my Indeedee here, which sucks. Uh, we're just going to double here and just pray our opponent... Because we, we need that around to... Just don't set Trick Room here, yeah? Don't set Trick Room. I, I have a feeling Mimi's just always clicking Trick Room here. I feel like his plan should be just to stall me out. Show me like a... Maybe like a Protect and a uh, another Luna Blessing. Your yeah, Luna Blessing's up. That means he did click Trick Room there, which kind of sucks. Yeah, that's fine. Damn, this is going to be really damn annoying, isn't it? So, we're just going to taunt this slot. We're going to get Didi back in. Dude, are you kidding me? What's he bringing in? Another sweeper? It's the Arcanine, at least. It should be a Shadow Claw into the Typhlosion slot here as well, which is going to be nice. Only issue here is I don't think we can actually stop the Trick Room now, can we? Man, we led this wrong. Yeah, there's the Shadow Sneak. That's fine. Also, Psychic Terrain... Dude, are you kidding me? I could have just thrown off an Eruption there. I also cut myself, apparently. Of course, of course. How long do I have left on this Trick Room, man? Three turns. Okay, how do I stall this out? It has to be Reggie Draco stalling this out for Flosion Endgame here, I think. So what I need to do here is... My opponent really doesn't put on the pressure here, so we can just go for a Bleak Wind. That's fine. Uh, and then we just try reverse the Tailwind, I guess. Okay. What's he going to bring in here? Is this Ursa Luna? Cresselia. He's just all about stalling me out, isn't he? Okay. Okay, we get the reverse trick room, which is nice. Why is he not attacking me, dude? This guy's like just here to try and stall me, man. Do I do it? Like, what's he clicking here? Nah, Flosion's my win con. I need Flosion alive. I need Flosion in there outside of the, the trick room to win this. Don't be mental, Herb. Please don't be mental, Herb. Yeah, of course he's mental, Herb. Like, I mean, of course he's always mental, Herb, but still, that's so annoying. Please miss the Drago. Oh, dude, why'd you hit the Mon I didn't want you to hit? Trick Room goes up. That's fine. So, I think he's always swapping here, right? Oh, I feel like he's just always swapping in Mimikyu here. You know, I think we just got to start going on the aggress aggressive. Yeah, this guy's j he's just stalling, man. Is this all homeboy wants to do? Like, why not fire off another Snarl into me, dude? Like, I, this is okay. I don't mind this. On the last turn of Tailwind, I'm going to just swap out on you. Oh, dude, that actually did nothing at minus one. You're kidding me. Of course I miss. All right, we're just going to taunt the Cresselia here.
just fire off a Draco here. Then I'll look to get in... D oh, do I want to get in DD in that turn? I don't know. With the way he's playing this, I really just need to... um. I really just need to get damage out and just stop him from healing constantly, right? Because I'm guessing he, like, surely he attacks and Lunar Blessings here. Yeah, there's the Snarl coming out. That's fine. We are Covet Cloak there as well. Oh, Future Sight in on the Reggie Drago slot's not fun. All right, boys, I see our win condition here. There, is that two turns left now? Three, two turns. Okay, so this is the turn we sunny day. And then this is also the turn we get the Indeedy in, yeah? And the reason for this... Oh, maybe... Because the plan is to now look to get our... um, Look to get our Typhlosion in on the left slot after this. Dude, this burn's actually such a nuisance as well, man. Of course, he morning suns just to go back to full HP, man. I give him extra healing there too. Dude, I don't even know if it's worth the risk here. I think we just let Indeedy die, right? This is the last turn, yeah? Yeah. Just go Bleak Wind Storm and just... Helping Hand, I think. Oh, just click Snarl, dude. Click Snarl, please. Yes, okay, thank God. Indeedy goes down. Indeedy going down is actually so important for me right now. Alright, uh, please tell me I hit the Arcanine. That's all I need. I need to hit Arcanine with this one and the next one. Dude, this homie's just cursing. Alright, uh, the good news here though is I do think we are in the position to... Dude, that has to hit Arcanine. That has to hit Arcanine. Thank God. Okay, the fact that that hit, uh, hits Arcanine puts us in a good spot here. 37. Okay, God, that just did what? 46 damage, which means we live one more. Oh, and finally... It gets its time to shine, boys. How do I want to do this? He can't shadow sneak me. I'm just going to stop this guy from healing, man. I'm sick of his shit. Like, sure, I could Bleak Wind to, like, guarantee it. But if, if Bleak Wind misses there and then he, like, Morning Sun's back to full, then it just feels shitty. All right, let's go, Typhlosion. Just click the nuke, man. Click the nuke. Taunt. Of course I can't taunt. I'm such an idiot. Oh, please KO. Please KO. Please KO. It stops the trick room for sure. Dude, if I just bleak wind stormed that, that was fine. Ah, oh, man. I'm such an idiot. And he gets his citrus berry to proc too. I mean, it wasn't fine, but I need a guav berry. And dude, he just morning suns up. <laughs> Curse. Yeah, always punished, boys. Always freaking punished. All right, the good news is I don't think Cresselia lives this, right? So we just go bleak win and we just go eruption. I wonder, what is that guy's last move, right? He's got... He's got Will-O-Wisp, Morning Sun, Blitz Protect? Like, is that it? He's also taking no damage on the Arcanine. He should really snarl me here, which is going to put me in a really shitty spot. I missed again, didn't I? God, dude, that's... I've missed two attacks on him now, I think. And there's the snarl. Dude, can you miss me with the snarl, please? All right, all right. Good news is we have Earth Power back in. Bad news is I don't know what his last mon is. Do I? I'm guessing it's... What would it be? It's either Ursa Luna or Quagsire, right? Distant Pass. That's uh, Luna, right? Yeah, that's Luna. That's fine. 
So I think we're free to go just for Earth Power left and we eruption here. Dude, watch him pull out. This is where he pulls out Earthquake right now and just beats me, isn't it? Oh, like we're minus one. We're locked into this eruption. Oh, what? Dude, Earth Power might pick this up with the eruption damage. I mean, like, yeah, sure, I'm minus one, but still, I think that's okay. It's definitely Earth Power range. Oh, man, okay. That should be GG unless we miss a Draco now. Oh, what an annoying game. I, I think I'm going to put this one at the end of the video just because this was rough, man. <laughs> like, this could not be a pleasant viewing experience. That's fine. He protects, he throws. Ah, <sighs> man, what a game. What a freaking game. Just drop the freaking Draco and take him, please. Just take him out with the Draco here. Like, the thing is, he probably just, like, clicks EQ and KOs me if I if I don't KO him here. Oh, God, that's still a lot of damage. Draco, I hit, yeah? Dude, I miss? Oh, my God. And he headlongs. Dude, this game's so cursed, man. I missed two Bleak Winds and a Draco? Oh, man. If I just clicked Earth Power, I would have won the game next turn, guaranteed. Is that like the first attack he's actually hit me with all game? All right, Draco, just hit. Yeah, just hit. There we go. There we freaking go. D-E-A-D. Did. Oh, man, what a game. Um... That was annoying, <laughs> to say the least. Um, all he did was willow me, curse me, and spam heals. Ah, spam trick room. It was... That was not fun, but look, we, we won the game. That's all that matters. Um, I really wish I had led that. Ah, see, even leading it better still doesn't really change anything, right? Maybe Chi Yuan lead was the play. I don't know. Look, GG to my opponent anyway. Um, very annoying match. Definitely going to throw that at the end, which means the outro is probably going to be after this. But yeah, I'll, look, I'm going to queue for another game. That's probably the last one you'll watch. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Um, if you guys could, obviously, let me know what you think of the team down below. Um, I really do appreciate the feedback. If there's any other Pokemon or teams you know you want me to build around, of course, let me know down there. Um, and as I said at the start of the video as well, guys, um, only like 18% of my viewers are subscribed. So, you know, if you made it this far, consider subscribing. Yeah, we're on the road to 2K subs. And if everyone who watches this video subs, I'm sure we can get to 2K pretty damn quick. Anyway, guys, that's going to be me for this one. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.